I think if uh, we were truly to unleash the immense tourism potential which our country has, the single most important policy reform, uh, in my opinion, would be the visa, visa regime. We have such a restrictive visa regime and uh, we have a very, in terms of the government, a very insular attitude towards foreigners. So here I'm not just talking about people in our neighborhood, but generally also. So as soon as that happens and as soon as you open things up and make it easier, Pakistan has so much to offer. And when tourism picks up, first domestic tourism and with a uh, less restrictive visa regime, international tourism, then the economic gains would start coming in. That will drive or incentivize the private sector to come in. So where the big gaps are in terms of infrastructure, in terms of hospitality industry, ancillary transport industry, which at the moment is not at par with international standards, that will also come in. But in my opinion, perhaps it's the visa regime which needs to change and for that, the attitude of our government needs to change. Okay, it has to move from insularity into something which embraces the world outside and in some sense a hospitality rather than a diffidence that come to our country and see what all we have to offer from the mighty Himalayas, Karakurams, great topography, great physical, beautiful physical features, so diverse to a rich millennia old history, okay, rich with tradition, rich with uh, antiquity, rich, rich in terms of architecture and rich in terms of culture, the living culture of the people and so diverse coming from Sindh, Balochistan, KPK, Punjab, so much to offer. If you look at the Punjab, Punjab is perhaps the most religiously most sacred, it's like the Mecca and Medina for the 30 million Sikhs, the diaspora Sikhs, those who are in our neighborhood in India. If, for example, you ease visa restrictions, you, had, you would have literally millions coming every day to visit the holy sites. And we did a basic estimation. If you open things up for both the Sikhs and, for example, the Buddhists, we estimate the Punjab alone could earn more than $2 billion per annum and create more than 400,000 jobs. Okay, And so that's a big, big plus to the economy of uh, the province and obviously contributes immensely to the country as well.